Hello! So today I thought I'll make a tutorial on the piece Primavera by the one and only Ludovico Einaudi. I'm having fun with the Italian lingo. Anyway, this is a very loved piece by him and I've been playing it as well. And I thought, well, perhaps some of you might be interested in learning it. And in this tutorial I'll just be playing each hand separately into tempos and then both hands together. And sometimes I'll be explaining something about the sheet music, but not much. Okay, there we go. Um, two things before you start always, it's the key signature and the time signature. The key signature essentially says which notes in the sheet music will be played differently, how they're written. For example, here we have three, what they're called, sharps is up and down is flats, I guess. Let's assume three flats. So it's this, this, and this. That means that for each A note in the sheet music, you will have to play A flat for the entire piece, unless stated otherwise. And that's very crucial because otherwise you know, it will just sound off if you forget these three. Every this note, every this, and every this note. There we go. I don't know what scale it is. It doesn't matter currently, but just three notes that you have to remember. And the time signature essentially means how many beats you have per bar. So if you play the first bar and you count till three, then it means you should have had you should have played all the notes already. And you can see the time signature here, it's three over four. Essentially you only look at the first number, it's three, and you know that there will be three three beats per bar. This is something I want to show you because also in this moment right now I do not remember how fast this piece should be played. It could be played like this, one, two, three, one, two, three, or one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. I don't know. But luckily for me, there is this little indication, the cheat code, uh, how fast this piece should be played. And if you have a metronome at hand, or probably you can Google for one, there should be an electronic version. Um, all you have to do, turn it on. Okay, nice. Ah, shut the... Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> Yay, good. Um, but in tempo, you should choose the first... Um, what it is? That's not a letter. What is it? Ah, number? Yes. <laughs> For, for beat, you should choose, um, I'm gonna stand so you can see this thing. So for beat, you're gonna choose, no, sorry, you're gonna choose three. Two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. On one, the metronome has a different sound. Okay. And this is how I should be playing, I guess. One, two, three, one. Okay, I'm gonna try doing something like this, but I might fail. Slower tempo now. One, two, three. 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 And again, of course, there's 
this little guy because of the key signature. That's it! Yay! We got the first row. Second row again, no notes in the right hand, only notes in the left hand. So second row, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, slower. One, two, three, one, two, three. And these little thingies indicate that as you play first row, you play second row till the first, I don't know what it's called, and then you repeat the entire thing again, play first row, and then when you play second row, instead of the part one, you will play part two. So it will be one, two, three bars, and then first, fourth bar will be this one, You're just ignoring this in the second row. And so that it makes sense, I'm gonna play um, left hand, the first two rows, with the repetition as well. Okay. One, two, three. Moving on, third row already. Um, here we have notes on the right hand. Luckily for us, they're quite few <laughs> and not that difficult in the rhythm. Mm, we'll see. Okay, so right hand, third row. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three, one, two, three. There you go, that's the line, and now slower tempo. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. And here in the sheet music we see, uh, I don't know what the how is how it's called in English, but essentially it's a cancellation sign and it cancels the key signature. This is an A and it, based on key signature, because it's one of these three, it should be a, a flat. But because it's canceled, it's now, you know, a, a regular A. But it only is valid for this one bar, so. And then everything else should again be an A flat. Okay, left hand, third row. One, two, three. So it's very similar, left hand is always going to be very similar, not always, but like for the first page is very similar to the beginning. Um, so this is ex exactly the same as before, this is also the same, and then here is a new one, and these two are again the same. It's just good for us because we don't have to memorize as much, yay! Okay, slower tempo. One. Slower tempo. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, 
three. <laughs> and I think it would be useful to play this bar because it's most complicated but so far. And essentially you're playing, um, you're starting together on one, then there's one note on the left hand, on two, again together, one note on the left hand, on three together, and then on the second part of three, you have one note in left hand and two notes in right hand. So it will be like one, two, three, again, one, two, three, okay, so fourth row, right hand, one, two, three, one, Two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, again. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Ta-da! Fun times with music. Okay, left hand. I'm here. Okay, left hand, fourth row. One, two, three. 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 And in slower tempo. One, two. together. Where am I? Again. <laughs> I'm lost. One. Yes. One, two, three. 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 Okay, again. <clears throat> One, two, three. Next page. <clears throat> um, and the right hand. <clears throat> One, two, three. 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 Um, essentially, when there's uh, a line like this, it means that you shouldn't take your finger off the keyboard. Uh, so yeah. So you shouldn't play like one, two, three, take it off, one, two. No, it's just, it's like a five because it continues from the three plus two from this note. One, two, three, one, two. Okay, slower tempo. One, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two. First row, second page. One, two, three, one, two, three, one.
again, it doesn't make sense this, just to stop at the end of the line just because it's the end of the line. If the melody con is finished right at the start of the next line, then just you know carry it onwards. Um, yep, and uh, slower tempo. One, two. Okay, um, slower. One, two, three, one, two, This we already played because of the extension from the first line, so I'm starting from here. So, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two. Okay, left hand uh, here, yes, yes, left hand again from here, one, Two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Again, makes sense to continue the melody just for the sake of understanding it better, I guess. A slower tempo. One, two, three. So I'm adding this in the right hand because you know it's there for the melody. One, two, three, 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 one. But I'm gonna include this in the next part of the right hand. So slower tempo. One, two, three. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. three. Okay, doki. So there was nothing groundbreaking in the in that line. And this is it. This is this is how much we're learning today. Whoa! The end is near. Okay. Uh, last row for today. All right, hand. Uh, where am I again? Counting the beat, even though we're not gonna play this one because that was the continuation. Um, one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One. Two, three, one, two, three. Slower tempo. One, 
two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. It's very annoying to count slowly for the notes that never change, but it's still a good practice, so do it. So left hand. One, two, three. So here we have some nice harmonies, slower tempo. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three. And again, here we have the cancellation sign. Maybe I will learn one day how it's called in English. No one knows. Um, <laughs> uh, but yeah, here in the left hand, it's easier for me to, to um, play these three notes with the fifth, second, first finger and then cross over uh, by with the third, second, first, and then cross over again with the second. So it makes sense for me. Maybe something else is easier for you, or maybe like fifth, fifth, and then. I mean, you never have enough fingers for all of these seven notes anyway, but this is just easy for me, and you can experiment with whatever. whatever is more comfortable for you. You know, there are no fingers indicated there, so you can do whatever you want. Okay, together. One, two, three, one. through all of it and um, yeah that's pretty much it this is what I uh, wanted to make today and uh, if any of you found this useful and you would like me to make a second you know to, to go over the pages um, then let me know in the comments I'm gonna make a second part and third part um, so yeah I might make a second part Anyway, if there are a lot of views, but you know, I kind of need to know what it is you want. Otherwise, I'm just gonna make like the first sheet of every song that I feel like. Yay! And uh, yeah, have a have a nice day. Bye.